Hello friends, <laughs> welcome to my channel. Uh, I recently graduated my BTEC in a stream of computer science engineering. So that's why I'm po lately come to my channel. Sorry, I'm coming back to my channel. So uh, today I want to start how to learn the Python. And every day I want to put some coding, coding patterns, coding things like coding problems. So it's easy way to understand how the logic has been written. So better to achieve some good knowledge to each and everyone. Knowledge sharing is the best thing in the world. So that's the reason I want to share my knowledge to each and everyone. If you like, if you want to suggest is there any type of wrong in my in my teaching, you can also comment in the section, comment box. So I don't uh, like, uh, I don't panic. So I want to do some knowledge and have some knowledge on the things also so that's the reason i want to i come to learn sorry, i come to give teaching on about python so today all are gadgeting okay but no one knows how to write the logic for the code learning python okay learning java okay learning c okay learning c plus <laughs> plus better to learn how to write the logic first thing i want to say that to write the logic for each and every python coding language not only python coding each and every programming co coding language you must put the pen and paper for each and everything okay without pen and pa inserting pen and paper we can't write small logic also okay for the first thing we must put the pen and paper in each and everything for the mathematical also we must we are putting the pen and paper small, small things to learn from first class so without putting pen and paper you can't learn small piece of pin also so that's the reason i want to say that if you're learning in a tutor or any tuition classes you must put the pen and paper otherwise you can't understand how to write the logic how to learn the logic how to know the logic also okay so basic thing understand i must i was clear you must also clear okay let's know how to install a python without mode we can't eat so that's like without python installation and without python program we can't execute any single file also we know also we all are know that python is an interpreter i know you also know that's that's like so i am using the microsoft edge you can use yours your own browser so type python dot org see let's i am using the web address it's a you can you can learn basics of this uh, edge browser also not an edge browser each and every browser also same interface you may see that uh, here see search and enter web address web address can be filled here only so we can type here web addresses like dot org dot in dot com is these these are things only here you are type here only no don't type here if you type here even google also even google or any other search engine it goes with search engine and shows the web, web website so if you type the web, right web, web address here it can go to the direct web address without contacting each and every search engine okay mm, try to use web address field only then the search engine field so i am using the web address field which is a python.org uh, what is this python.org python.org is an official website by python and you also know uh, you already all, all of you know uh, who is the uh, founder of python and uh, father of python sorry and uh, i want to tell this website feature this website feature is uh this website is an open source platform what is open source platform open source platform is nothing but it can be used you uh, can use the tools which can be downloaded from this platform the pla platform provides those tools with a free of cost open source is nothing but a free of cost which can be in which the platform is uh, is a is said to be open source it can be free of cost tool okay like python also it's a free of cost tool only okay uh, like if you take the Java, Oracle Java, Java is also free of cost tool only. Like if you take the uh, DevC, DevC also, DevC plus plus is also free of cost tool only. So let's like you are using the open source platform means if you are going to open source platform, it's nothing but a free of cost tool. Okay. Uh, let's elaborate this website and go to this website and I want to download the Python. No? Let's come to a point. I just click the downloads. Here it shows that download latest version of Python. Okay. And after that, it shows the Windows. <laughs> Let's go. Cool. Uh, I am using the Windows. Let's see what's the Windows version. I am using the Windows version. For me, I know. For who don't know, you can go to settings and go to system and go to about here about. You can see that Windows 
Asian Windows and Home single language. If you want to know that, we can know for by using the run. You can go run and type MS Info and click OK. Here you can see what is Microsoft Windows 11 Home single language. Let's go and download the Python. If you want to download for Mac and Linux, it can it detects easily by uh, download Windows. Sorry, download latest version for Mac OS or download latest version for Linux. You can detect easily. Okay. And uh, if you want to download uh, from for manually in this Windows platform only, you can download here by popping here. It shows Windows, Mac OS, other platforms. Okay. I will try to go to Mac OS. It shows what's the releases and what's the uh, stable releases are there and pre releases are there. You can download by clicking on the link only. Okay. So I want to go to its official website. Uh, it shows my platforms and it can be downloading. Sorry for late downloading. It takes some time. Today my Wi-Fi is a issue. Okay, so let's learn who is the father of Python. I know Guido Van Rosam. He is the father of Python. I know I don't know. I sorry, I know not. Each and everyone who is learning Python must know the main thing who is the father of Python, Guido Van Rosam. He is the father of Python in which he created a language in the late 18, 1980s, okay, in the late 1980s, and he released the first version of the Python in 1991, and he continued to be a lead developer and a guiding force for the language for many years, ending the little, ending the title of like a uh, Python community in Python community, and also he he also stepped down to from the role in 2018, uh, something I don't know, okay. Uh, the Python was also downloaded now. Let's open the file. I'm opening the Python file. Just click open file and here use like checkbox. Check this use admin privilege when installing python.exe. And also, main thing check box add python.exe to path because if you don't check this path, it can be set it as manually. So, please, each and every person, please check this uh, add python.exe to path. Otherwise, you, know, you can face some problems while developing some tools, like several, several, while writing some programs in VS Code, etc. So that's the reason command prompt also it cannot work without uh, adding this Python to the path. Okay, better to uh, check, 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 put a tick in the checkbox. And I am installing now my Python. It asked some admin privileges. Click yes, and it was installing. takes some time it, it doesn't require any internet connection also so just download the for downloading a file you can know the extension of the file dot exe means it's a file to download it's a file is a uh, useful for to install the uh, application in the windows okay dot exe is a file installation so it's an uh, extension for the application to in install in the windows so in was setup was progressing installing So my Python was set up for successful. It was installed in my laptop. So I want to close. So okay, I want to open the CMD. And after the opening the CMD, let's check whether my Python was installed or not. Here we can see that Python version. My Python installation version is 3.12.6. Okay, it's better to know 3.12 is my Python version. This 6, 7, 8 is uh, versions to which you are upgrading each and every three months or two months. So don't worry about that. If you are using the 3.12.7 or 8, otherwise you can use the 3.13 also. My in in uh, time of my uploading my video, there is the latest version 3.12. Okay, don't worry. And I also check for PIP version. PIP version is a uh, sorry. PIP is a is the uh, package. Which I want, which we want to install each and every package from the Python library, open source library. So I am also checking the Python PHP version. It is 2.24.2. Okay, my Python was successfully installed, and I am want to open the IDLE. Python was contained IDLE, which is nothing but a shell uh, to uh, interpret the each and every uh, programming, sorry, each and every uh, Python code course. So I want to open the IDLE. I don't know what's IDLE. So let's see what's the full form of IDLE also. Uh, 
ideally full form let's learn with each and every one integrated development learning environment ideally means integrated development and learning environment if anyone interview asked what's the ideally full form you can must say integrated integrated means the python shell was integrated with python platform only and learning environment it contains some learning tools also so we must say that ideally full form is integrated development learning environment and this the meaning is it was already integrated to development each and every code in the python id uh, uh, with a python shell and it can be uh, useful for learning environment also that's a that's a meaning of ideally so it's a full form of ideally okay let's go uh, shell it's uh, the shell contains something like uh, python 3.12.6 it's a version of my python and uh, it contains like type help copyright grades or license for more information so okay this is the shell this is the interface of my python shell and if you are in your laptop it is a mac os or linux anything it's a windows anything is the shell how does the shell was appear in your in your laptop okay which os is nothing but it's not it's not a uh, it's not a it's not a word but it is a Python shell is same in each and every one, and it's a open source platform. Also, open source platform is nothing but which each platform can uh, can use this uh, uh, extension. So today I want to stop with this video only. So thanks for seeing my video. Okay. Nice.